This is a Johnson University online tutorial. Publishing a course site. One of the last things that needs to be done is to make the course site available to students. At this point, you should have already corrected or modified open, due, and accept until dates, published assignment, assessment, and discussion form entries, and verified links throughout the course. Making the course site available to students should be done on or just before the official start date of the course. If you're not sure of the start date, check with your school's dean or program director. You may also find the information posted on the university website. Courses must not be published significantly earlier than the official start date, as doing so could give some students an unfair advantage or opportunity to have additional time to complete coursework. You can tell a course is not published by looking near the top. Under your list of course sites, you'll see Unpublished Site next to a Publish Now button. To publish or make the course available to students, follow these steps. 1. In the course site, select the Publish Now button near the top. The course is now available to students officially registered and enrolled in the course. To unpublish a course site, follow these steps. 1. In the course site, select Site Info. 2. In Site Info, select Manage Access. 3. On the Change Access page under Site Status, 4. Select Leave as Draft, accessible only to site maintainers. 5. Select the Update button near the bottom. Now let's see each of these in action. First, I'll go and publish this Hebrew 5000 course. I can see the course is not published right away regardless of which area of the course I'm in. Right at the top, I see the words Unpublished Site. To publish the course, I simply need to select the Publish Now button. Once I've done so, the site status message disappears. The course site is now available to students. To unpublish the course site, I'll follow the directions listed earlier. In the course site, select Site Info. In Site Info, select Manage Access. On the Change Access page under Site Status, select Leave as Draft, accessible only to site maintainers. And last, select the Update button near the bottom. I can now see the Site Status message at the top again, Unpublished Site. Students expect to see the course on the first official day of class. Online courses include all the same material and meet all the same objectives of face-to-face -face courses but in a shorter, more compressed time frame. Making the course available by publishing it on time is a critical step for student success. More information on these and other topics is available in other tutorials and documentation. This is a Johnson University online tutorial.